What's up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel and today's video we're gonna be looking at Sin. He is currently item shop. He is a reactive outfit. He does have two selectable styles. He is part of, part of the parallel future set. He does come with the backing stellar jaunt. So without further ado guys, let's get the review started. So Sin, a very odd skin. I would have pictured them releasing this skin during season 9 which was all very futuristic but I don't know man the back itself is decent again it's a very odd skin and back one. his selectable style you do see him wearing some futuristic glasses and that's about it he does react whenever he does take damage so you could take a note for that does he match his rarity that's the thing about him i don't really think he matches his rarity he has a lot of very odd colors the skin itself is very odd itself and the whole set is just i don't know it's bizarre to me so what's my final rating for sip i'm gonna have to give sim a 6 out of 10. i don't know the back lane is decent the skin itself even though it does have a selectable style it is still very very poorly designed i really don't see myself spending a thousand five hundred V bucks for him. He would, if he would have been a rare, I could be more lenient to the rating. But as it stands right now, being an epic, I don't think he's worth your money. So without further ado, guys, let's get these combos started. For the first combination with Sid, I am pairing him up with the Sunwings. The customs of the Sunwings being an all orange design and a little bit of like a lighter orange in the end of the wings matches really well. His coat does have very unique colors, which is like a red -y orange in the bottom, an orange in the center, and yellow. The main reason why I'm using it is for that orange crusty. It matches pretty good. Also, with his cap, he does have, and overall, it's real good. For the Harvey tour, we're going with the Pig Squeak. The color schemes of the Pig Squeak matches every single color scheme he does have. The yellow, the red, the orange, even the light blue matches really good with the blue he does have. For the glider, I'm going with the Bounce Away. The Bounce Away, the color scheme, it's phenomenal. It does have red and yellow, and then you can tell the hardening tool and the skin itself also utilizes the same color scheme. For the contour, I'm going with the fiber optics. The fiber optics are very colorful contour. It matches pretty good every color he does have overall, and overall, very flashy. And for the wrap, I'm going with the burn mark. The burn mark goes from a orange to a reddish orange color scheme, and that's the same thing that the skin does. It matches really well with the orange color scheme, and it just fits phenomenal. So enjoy the combo. combination with Sid, I am pairing him up with the backboard with the fish stick edit style. I do like the fish stick edit style just for the simple fact that the backboard itself is completely all orange. The orange matches really well with the skin and then the fish stick hand it, that does have in the backboard is yellow so it matches really good with the yellow. And for the harvesting tool we're going with the bite mark. The bite mark is exactly the same thing as the skin. The color skin is red with yellow as you can tell the skin does utilize the same colors. The back lane itself is very goofy and so is the harvesting tool. The glider I'm going with the flying carp. Again I am using the fish stick with the backboard so having the flying carp actually ties in very nicely. The main reason is for the color scheme. The color scheme of that reddish orange color scheme that the fish is and then having that white that really complements the pants it does have and then you do have those glow things that are glowing light blue that complement the light blue of the skin. The contra I'm going with the lava. The lava is basically an all orange contra. It fits really good with the skin itself and overall fits nicely. The wrap I'm going with the goosebumps. The goosebumps is an animated wrap. It does have orange and light blue. As you can tell, the skin does have the same color schemes, so it looks very cool together. So enjoy the combo.
for the last combination with the synth skin, I am pairing it up with the Astro World with the orange color scheme. I really do love this back thing on this character itself. The core of the Astro World itself is bright orange that really complements the orange the skin does have in his hat. Then in the back knee itself also has little patches of green grass that overall complements the skin very nicely. For the harvesting tool, we're going the Mega Axe. The Mega Axe is a very futuristic harvesting tool. The color scheme of orange and then the orange frame on the harvesting tool itself matches really good with the core of the back knee itself and overall brings the whole combination very tight. For the glider, I'm going with the white wing. The skin itself does have a lot of futuristic vibes to him, so having the white wing a uh, futuristic glider is very very nice. I really do like it. The all white design on it complements really good with the white the skin does bring to the table. And then the thrusters are like orangey red that really complements the skin as well. For the contra, I'm going with the vibrant. The vibrance, what the name implies, is a vibrant contra. It does have a lot of very silly colors, but it overall fits them really well. And for the wrap, I'm going with the triangles. The triangles is basically orange triangles or yellow flying into the back of the weapon or vehicle. It matches really good depending on the weapon you have. It just looks very cool. So enjoy the combo. Those are three combinations I've found so far for Sith. Let me know in the comments below which one's your favorite. And if you're new to my channel, subscribe. I post videos of your favorite cosmetic skins every single day. And if you want to support the channel, my code is Enigma Kid, all caps to these, all together. Each time you guys use my code, either the item shop or the Epic Game Store, I do get a small percentage of it and really help the channel grow. Also, if you have any suggestions for me to cover a skin that's either in a battle pass or a starter pack, let me know in the comments below as well. And with that being said, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. See ya.